Howdy folks and welcome back once more to Let's Play Ravenloft Strahd's Possession. Today, we're actually not going to bother talking with her. She's just another magic user. And we already have plenty of those. Mage Scroll Chill Touch. Count Strahd's Writ, huh? What's this? By the authority of our Lord Strahd von Zarevich, the following rumors are to be stamped out of the minds of the Burgomasters warriors and peasants of the villages of Ravenloft. Anyone repeating them is to be put to death without trial and before making any public statement. Wow. Uh, they are. And then our lord is involved in any way in the arts of necromancy, that Strahd has made a pact with death to obtain his heart's desire, or has therefore been transformed in any way, that the Baal Verzi dagger used to kill Strahd's brother was the last known to be in Strahd's possession. We literally own that. Uh, that the woman Tatiana plunged to her death while attempting to escape the embrace of Stratton von Zarevich. I'm pretty sure all of those things. Uh, less the dagger one are actually true. Ooh, burning hands. Wonderful. All right, Rove. Welcome to AoE. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I saw another another third level spell slot on him. I did. How did I miss that? Unless I didn't, and we probably just died if I had to guess. Well, if we just come into this guy's house, he's like, yeah, Strahd wants to see you, it's kind of important. We just come into his house, take his things, start fires, and, and like sleep for nine hours. Ice knife? Yeah, hey, ice knife is just another projectile spell. But why would we use that when we have uh, Agonazer Scorcher, because I think Ice Knife's second level? Yes. Yeah, there's there's no way Ice Knife is going to be better than Agonazer's is. Now, where... Where was that room that had those oils of fiery burning? Given the general lethality of this game, I should probably actually take those. Van Richten's Guide to Weir Beasts, and... Ew, another Squirrel of Rage Dead. All right. This, I think, we have two of them already. Wonderful. Let's... Let us begin... Collecting them in a Squirrel Case. Thank you, Light Wins. There's so many fucking daggers. Okay. This is healing, right? Yes. Healing bag can go in there. Uh, Two-hander field. The daggers that I don't know if they're magical or not. Um, this was tentatively a mace. And the rest of this is acceptable. Okay, Van Richten's Guide to Weird Beasts. A long and rigorous examination of the facts leads to but one conclusion, that curing the infected lycanthrope is a difficult enterprise. No shortcuts have been found, and it remains our learned opinion that none exist. First, the primary weird beast causing the infection must be located and destroyed. Often painstaking research is required to locate this beast, known as the progenitor, especially when a chain of lycanthropic infection is involved. Once you're certain that the progenitor has been destroyed, the next stage of the cure may take place. To begin, the subject must assume his secondary form, whatever difficulties that may involve. Then three spells must be cast upon the beast in quick succession. Atonement, cure disease, and remove curse. Finally, once restored to human form, the infected creature must atone for his deeds with acts of constant good. I think this is important. I'm gonna hold on to that. It might be of some import. I don't know. I wanna get back to looting this man's house. Is it in here? No. It's in here. Aha! Give me that. Here you go, Rove. You can sit in the back and, like, firebomb things. Can he not throw these? He seriously can't throw them. We probably have to, like... Does that have to be in the front row? You have to be in the front row to throw these things, but reality, like, what it really means is I'm just going to pick them up with my mouse cursor and lob them that way. Probably more accurate anyways. What else do we have? A couple more rooms by the look of things. I love just breaking into houses, taking things, and then leaving. I really like... Oh, 
wall textures in here. I have to like come through this in like my own time and hmm, like because one of the things that I'm working on in Udcrawler currently, uh, I've been dumping a bunch of time into the map editor for it. Wrong button. And in doing so, making textures for walls and stuff. I have a feeling that these are probably higher resolution than the textures I'm using. Uh, the ones for Cudcrawler... What is this? This might be area transition. Uh, the ones for Cudcrawler's walls, they're only 32 by 32, so they're not, like, super packed with detail, but, like... I don't know. These don't look like they're... I don't know. I don't know. But, like, I like some of the, some of the detail on these. It's pretty nice, and, and they're varied enough that it makes it interesting to look at. Okay, so can I open? this then oh no is this outside is this where we came in oh no there's a side door okay so he has two uh two entrances okay all right so then we've explored his place unless there's stuff hiding out back we should probably poke around i've been told that for the um the paladin's quest all i need to do to not fail it we just need to oh i see you somebody's getting a, a burning hands Burning hands is so fucking in by you guys. Anyways, the only thing that I need to do to not fail the Paladin's quest is that there's apparently a pick in this town. Ow, dude, bro, 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 magic missile. Oh, 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 oh get fucked, kid. Old person down there's another one. Oh God, he survived. Darklings, man. Oh, we're poisoned. That's, uh... I think that's pretty much a game over. Unless I find some ointment. You gotta love it. Where they nail you with the poison when you have, like, no recourse. There's just no way to get, a, get it off of you. I think a lot of old D&D games did. Where it's just like, get fucked, son. Entering a home uninvited is a skill at which I excel, as luck would have it. The purity of my elven face often calms those who I come upon unaware. They believe I'm a goodly spirit momentarily confused as I wander through their mortal world. Alright. That's a dangerous assumption to make in Rove's case. Because he's as liable to burn your house down as anything. And yes, that's why I didn't reload. I know that there's more tchotchkes about town that may be of middling use to us. We did just save, but... It's like, yeah, like, this looks sharp as fuck, but I mean, like... Yeah, no, that's... That's, that's probably, like... These are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 20... Well, these are actually... <laughs> by my... Com comparatively much larger textures. Oh my god. Really, guys? The, the entire the entire town is here trying to kill me. Fuck off. Good lord. Any more levels? Uh, I think chunk level thief. That's about it. Falcon is... Falcon is doing what Falcon does. Temptation to just keep him with me. I might actually keep him with me throughout this entire playthrough. Because, like... I'm gonna trade Velika out for the Cleric. I know that much. There's much to be said for appearing friendly to the natives and possibly winning allies among them since we've stepped within this home and announced a cautious and friendly approach is best. Can we even... Oh, we can talk to this guy. He won't talk, nor does it look like he cares to move from that chair of his. The best can be done is to let him sit and stare away whatever years are left to him. He's a gamer. Too much Fortnite, that's what it does. Rots your brain. Beware, kids. Are you an NPC? Yes, you're just some... Ow, fuck! Where? Look at this! This fucking throng of, of just murderous hobos. This is ridiculous. 
Are you like assassins sent from Strahd or something? Is that what this is meant to be? <laughs> Get fuego, you son of a bitch. No, oh, it's terrible. I'm stuck in the corner. This is a darkling. He needs to die. Good God. I need to find a house and sleep before the, the fucking entire town descends upon me here. I forgot that the beginning of this game is like basically fucking survival horror. Whew. All right. I probably should go see Strahd, I guess. Cruel to say, but this is not a happy, jovial place to be. Our dare say I have plastic villages where a plague has left them with more life than we'll find here in Barovia. Sir, this is a Wendy's. I do like that you can just like click on these doors to open them. Oh, hey, look, more fire. Thanks, guys. Give me that. Your Velika can hold two of them. Oh, is there another one? Oh, there is. Rove, Rove can also hold two of them. There we go. All right, I should like be marking off which houses we've been into so that I'm not like constantly wasting our time here. Well, hello, friend, you look different. Oh, you're the dude from the from outside. You don't mean to intrude, but are you all right? Yours is one of the few doors not barred to us and we're in search of information. The door unlocked. If I left the door open again, does it matter now that my son is lost? You have no idea how I've searched. No idea. The townsfolk talk as if I never had a son. Or as if he's been dead for years. If only the dreams would tell me more. Dude's crazy. Uh... We thought to ask for assistance, but you look as if you might need our help. Are you well? Oh, my dear son. He's not alive. Not in Barovia. I can tell you that. Our father feels these things. He knows them in his dreams. The dreams. I've seen the dead, bloodless face of the boy, my son. And I've heard him speak. In dreams, he tells me he will be avenged. And then lightning strikes in the forest, and he is gone. I remember none of this. Sorry, dude. Your son, if you had one, is a corpse in the woods somewhere. Go become an arborist. See, like... Ah. Oh, it's a nice-looking game. Like, I think of all of them that we've played up to this point, I think this has, like, the best interior design. Like, these houses look like fucking houses. I'm having, I am having a, a, a gay old time here. All right, I'm going to mark this. And then I want to do crazy guy. Dead son. We do, oh, no question marks. All right. I'm, I'm thankful that they gave me enough room to make notes. Oh, I see you down there, you fucks. Oh, you're not a bandit, you're just a rando. Okay. Uh... Like, if nothing else, I can, like... I don't know, just, like, look how they've done some of this art and... purloin it. Although, like... Man! Like, this looks so cool. Like, a shelf with, like, the webs and shit in it. Ah! Oh, I love it. I love it! Entering home uninvited, yeah, and he's also not gonna... Yeah. What has befallen a land where those who have nothing left to lose won't part with a simple smile? Symbol of raven kind there, maybe? It's probably like a weird raven or something. Okay... Oh! Fucking rats, man! In here, yes, we can. Okay, that it. That is it. So 
This is much smaller on the inside. Well, I think that back is probably about the same size. Touche game. Not pulling the hole. It's bigger on the inside. Oh. What is with these daggers? Oh, I'll take the Kyog Toms, though. Wait a minute. No, okay. All right. Oh, hello, kitty. I'm gonna assume that cat is asleep and not dead. Woe unto the cats of Ravenloft. Or that must be a... Tough get. Alright, where's the door to this place? Ah. Oh, it's boarded. It would seem some places were not meant to enter, regardless of our efforts. Best to waste no more time and nor muscle on this door, but to move on. Man, I wonder if they're gonna do the... Lands of Lore thing, where there'll be a door that appears, like, boarded up, but you can actually go into it. All right, more, more feral cats. Oh, we need an H. I think we came in here, didn't we? Yes. Hey. I think I remember where the cleric is. I don't know if we can actually get there at this point, though. Barovia. Is it through here? Is this like the graveyard area? No. Svalich Road North. We should really probably go see Strahd. But he's kind of a dick. And I would really rather not waste any XP. God, look at all of them. Okay, go burning hands. This, oh, this is Castle Ravenloft. Heh. Okay, I guess we came here on our own. I mean, I don't... Look at all those things just sitting over there. No. No, this is not... Music's going hard, apparently. Is that a fucking bandit stuck? No, it's a corpse. Heh. Okay. Oh, there's something over here. Just, I think she's in like, she's like in the area near that. Like, there's like this temple or something we end up going to. Peasants need not have hidden at my approach. I'm not here to raid the place. What on earth am I supposed to do with so much quiet? Maybe we've come on a holiday where the folk gathered in one great hall. Yes, that's it. We'll soon hear them singing from the other side of town, dancing to such a beat. I'll be tempted to frolic with them. But no, I don't hear a breath. Not one. Yeah. That's because it's it's Barovia. Place is kind of a shit pile. Is this it? Wooded area. I'd forgotten how large this game was, like exterior wise. Dog, oh, you fuck! I'm gonna throw another one! <laughs> Ah, oh, I didn't mean to- wait. If I just click, they'll throw them? Oh my god. Okay. I know what the cleric looks like. She's like a woman in a white robe. Where is the- oh My god, look at all these fucking things. Burning hands, man. Fucking greatest spell ever. Oh, who would have thunk the doors of the front of the place where there's a trail leading up to it? Lord. Y'all got anything worth stealing in here? I'll be with you momentarily. Larceny first. Hello, kitty. Uh, nothing. Alright. Before I talk to you, let me... rank down the cycles. I don't remember this. I think that's a man. Yes. How are you today, sir? There aren't many with the courage to live alone out here, now that I've seen. And what do you see? What can you 
see beyond light, beyond dust motes stirred in some corner near a window, or some brief flash in the sky which frightens you to the bone. When I see the echo of your thoughts and hear the scent of your fear. Ha! Ah, you think me mad, but magic does that, doesn't it? I am mad with magic. Alright, dude's crazy. Ah. Uh... Would you take the air on my side? Wait, what? No. God, how many mages does this game have? Yeah, we're, we're just going to leave. He can stay here and keep his weird ramblings to himself. I don't even know if he'll join us, but I have enough arcane bullshit in this party for the time being. I would really like a cleric because good God, these 73,000 hour sleeps kind of killing me. More fucking bet. God damn, burning hands. See an NPC up here? Oh, burn. Get him! Get him! It's one bat. What can it do? Who are you? Who are you? Are you the cleric? This might be the cleric. Uh, for your own safety, would you join us as we tour the caverns? Surely the day is not as glum as the expression in your eyes would have it. I'm gonna be an asshole about it. You, would you join us as we travel, totally tour the caverns? For safety's sake, I laugh at you. Yet I am here because I have not found the path which will allow me within the caverns. Should I trust you? I have but one goal: to leave this malodorous and filthy land. Somewhere in those subterranean passages lies a portal. Where it will take me, I know not. But if you help me reach it, yes, I will join you. Velika, you're out. Uh -oh. We don't actually know if we can enter the caverns yet, but uh, eh, now nah, we believe we can enter the caverns. Can you guide us to the portal? It can be found. How fortunate our encounter that by chance I have means to enter the place, that chamber where the portal lies. The portal by Velika. I think she goes to the blood of the vine. I think most NPCs do. Erm guard, whether given grudgingly or not, your assistance is welcome. I, I've, I've not been doing voices for Rove. I need to I need to step up my game. One thing appears true and that we shall not find our way through the portal in the caverns without you alive and well at our side. All right, so she is the cleric level six even wonderful. OK, um, you have any memorized spells now? Fucking bruh, you're a skeleton. Turn undead. Very effective. even know ah <sighs> okay um i guess i'll just dump a bunch of whole person spells on her just like uh, no spiritual hammer even in this one all right um negative plane protection is going to be a big deal in this game and i'll take a cure disease as well all right can we just have a nappy? No, too many monsters. Some rocks. What else is laying on the ground? Oh. Velika's gear here, which I think is just some dumpster tier armor. I mean, we have a mace, but like I said, I don't know what's magical or not, so let's go back. And this is, realistically, this is probably the party that we're going to run through the game with. There will be one point where we have totally not Strahd in the party, 
and we'll have to drop Falcon for a little bit, but that's temporary. See, only 16 hours that time, so the first thing we're doing is act magic. Uh, oh, I cast Cure Light Wounds. How did I? Whatever. Whatever. Okay, so what do we have here? Garbage. Garbage. Magical. Uh, wow. All right. I don't care about any of this stuff then. And this shield, I'll have Falcon hold on to it, but realistically, I'm probably not gonna ever have him use it. At some point, we will end up dumping it. Well, now we can use some of these cleric cure spells, which is a win in my book. All right, cool. Actually, can she? Does she have magical vestment? No. Ah. Party's just gonna have dumpster tier AC for the rest of this playthrough. I should probably have her have light instead of robe. Because I think at this point in the game, his his uh, burning hands is just going to be way more useful than a light spell. Look at him, you fucks. Damn ants. All right. Now that the party is formed, let's go find that guy's that guy's house here. We're going to end this episode the same place we started it last time. Jesus, somebody fell over in town. So this is good. We could probably hit a couple more buildings here. We got we got the time, I think. I'm trying to keep these episodes as close to half an hour as possible. For the most part, I do occasionally go over and under but 30 minutes seems to be like kind of the the happy point for for viewers if i follow like my actual like youtube analytics the happy point is actually about 15 minutes but i don't want my let's plays to be like a thousand episodes long so we're we're not doing 15 minute episodes okay There's like a there's like a weird raven in this town somewhere, isn't there? Or like a a, a weird bear or something. Which weird bears are actually good. Like they're good aligned. Like and I think they're chaotic good. I came to destroy you. Yet in tasting the will of this body, I know you to be different than those who slew us long ago. My name would have been Strobel then, a humble jeweler. He and his keep by the skill of his hands, content in both life and the love of his wife and children. Now I am vengeance, unappeasable, unwilling to forgive. I have risen up to exact revenge on those who murdered us. And though I will not kill you, I will use you! He who took our lives was called Victor Grimmick. In the years to follow, he became rich, a powerful man capable of escaping all justice. At last, it is believed he escapes death himself and rules still from the darkness of his own tomb. Where'd, where'd what's her face go? Oh god. What? Oh, we're possessed. That's neat. Did she fucking ditch us because we didn't? Oh, we got his bone vault key. All right, well, let's let's troll through his house here. Oh, hey. 
But seriously, though. Uh, she totally left as soon as we came into town. Oh, my God. No. This is like a raging pain in the dick. I'm going to reload and check something really quickly here. I want to see if she leaves, if she says something, because like there was that menu that popped up or that message that popped up. Uh... How rude, yeah, to leave without even a word in parting. What sullen ways that wandering woman showed. No doubt she has returned to her camp along the Ivalis, found if the need is rise. Oh my god. I love it. The only cleric in the game, and they're going to make her a raging asshole. I'm pretty sure she's the only cleric in this. Be happy to be wrong. Fuck off. Ooh. Fucking get out of here, you stupid bat. Can we go into the caverns? We may be getting distracted momentarily. I don't think we can get in yet. I know we totally can. So, no, we can't, because, yeah, we need, like, Strahd to get in here, I think, don't we? I don't think we can pick this. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's irksome. That is incredibly, incredibly irksome. Why would they do that? Like, here's this NPC you won in your party, and she's, like, she's even got the Rona mask on. Damn it. All right, well, that that sucks some pretty substantial, but I have to go without a cleric for a while. It seems mostly annoying more than anything, but I do think I'm going to go ahead and call it here. <sighs> so as usual, folks, thank you for watching. I'll be a good time and I will see you all next time. We're in bad assault continues until then. Hey, you made it to the end. Nice. If you had a good time. Check out one of these other series. See if you like them. Drop a like, comment, or subscribe if you'd like to support the channel, be the machine and all that. And as always, thanks for watching.